Deathcore Dre, no brain in the industry. The things about the entertainment industry you might not know, but I'm going to get you hip. Man, I'm sure you done seen this. It's all over the place. I, I think it happened yesterday. Yesterday was Mother's Day, if I'm not mistaken. But more of the story, it's an NBA player named John Morant. John Morant got suspended again after going live and showing himself holding a firearm. <laughs> All right, so if you don't know, he apparently got in trouble before with a, a firearm in a club or something, showing guns or something, got him in trouble, got him suspended. What ends up happening is late, late uh, yesterday, he posted it. Well, his man's was on live, and basically, people see him with a firearm again. So he ends up getting suspended and banned from whatever team. I can't remember what team. I think it was the Grizzlies or something. He got suspended from all activity from them. But he basically gets in trouble again for firearm possessing and showing firearms. So here's an argument that I keep seeing people pull up, keep seeing people bring up. Some people agree with it. Some people don't. But I'm going to break it down so some of y'all can understand. So there's a rapper named Blockboy JB. All right. So Blockboy JB, JB defends Ja Morant. This is what he says. Guns are not illegal. If he turned in his car with his gun that's in his name and he's in his yard and somebody records him, that's not on him. Free Ja. Okay. So this is the thing. Blockboy JB is 100% correct. Guns are not illegal. And some people are, you know, basically piggybacking on that, saying the same thing. Like, guns are not illegal, so why why y'all tripping off of him and da-da-da-da-da. But this is what y'all fail to understand. Because I see people arguing it inside of this comments. On, this is on Say Cheese's um, Instagram. I see people in the comments arguing that NBA has different rules and da-da-da-da-da. And then some people are trying to argue against that, saying that it doesn't matter, guns are, are legal, and so forth. And let me help y'all understand why being under contract matters. If you're going to apply certain stipulations to some people and don't apply to everybody else, it's not fair. Now, let me explain to you why being under contract can make situations like these make sense of why he's suspended again. When you have certain jobs, right? Certain jobs put you on a contract and they don't want you to do certain things. You know, like for instance, somebody works for a police department, right? The police department don't want that person making videos, cursing, saying crazy, belligerent things and posting that online. Now, even though cursing and saying belligerent things like, F this F these type of people F that da, da. You can do all of that That's not illegal But because Of who they work for They don't want them To do that And if they do do that They are at risk Of losing their job Same reason like You see in the videos Of like people For instance like White people Racist people right Like a video of a white person Working for some type of Corporate Or big entity job And there's a video Of that person Saying something racist To somebody or referring, you know, ma making some type of phrase that could be racist. Not actually saying a racist word, but they might say, oh, monkeys or something, right? Y'all yeah, be real quick to jump on their back and jump on the job that they work for to get them up out of here. And the job just might do that. That is what's happening to Ja Morant right now. The NBA don't allow or don't want you to present this public perception. They don't want you to be engaging in certain things and that's just how it is when you're under contract though firearms might be legal and where he is he might be legally allowed to have the firearm the nba does not want to be associated with certain type of activities certain type of behaviors and that's what i don't think people are understanding but that's just to kill man i mean you work for a certain job they want you to conduct yourself a certain way then that's just what it is so as a result of all of this john moran has been slapped with another suspension Unfortunate, but that's just what it is, my nigga. I don't understand. So let me, let me get down. Let me get down to the real kill. Hey, yo, son, listen. Let me tell you some real shit. I'm from the hood, man. All my niggas is from the hood. I know. You know what I'm saying? I I, I grew up in the hood. I'm st still. I'm not out here no more. I moved out of the hood, but I still go back to the hood. I still go around the way. I see all my niggas, all that. 
This is the thing, man. I don't understand. Apparently, this man right here grew up in a nice neighborhood, went to a private school, all that. But your man want to be a goon. He act, he moving around, acting like a goon. I remember there was something about him trying to fight like a a, a, a youngin at a high school. All, bro, listen. I'm going to tell you right now, I trade everything I had, all my experiences in the hood to not grow up in the hood, bro. Y'all don't be understanding the traumatized, the traumatization that growing up in the hood has done on, on, on a lot of us, man. Like, y'all listen to the music, the rap music, and, you know, a lot of y'all aren't from where we from. Y'all haven't experienced what we, what we experience, and it just seems like cool and, like, something to be on. Like, it just seems like it's cool to be like that. Man, listen. A lot of us are like that because we were bred like that. We grew up like that. It's second nature to us to be like that. We're not putting on the front. Your man right here, stop putting on the front. All y'all living in the suburbs, stop putting on the front, bro. Listen, we are traded. Y'all living in a big house. Your mama a goddamn fed. Your fucking, your, I mean, your damn dad is a goddamn lawyer, man. Listen, go ahead, man. Listen to the music, do all that. But stop acting like you a goon, bro. You're not a goon, man. Most of us don't even want to be out here. Most of us wish we had bread. Be able to get the things that we wanted as a kid growing up. Y'all got y'all got to stop this shit, man. But listen, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. If you ain't gonna do nothing else, subscribe, like, comment. This is no brainer industry. The things about the entertainment industry you might not know, but I'm gonna get you hip. John Morant, stop the bullshit, fool. Stay on your shit, man. You, you making two hundred some million dollars and da 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 da. My nigga, cut the bullshit out. Stay on your P's and Q's, fool. Keep your money, because you got to realize they don't want you associated with this type of shit, bro. They don't want you to be up anyway, man. You're a black man. They're going to try to get you up out of here. Stop playing these games. And we're out. <laughs>